this segment of Wild Bob Hunting is brought to you by Van Lee's Garage, engine. your SCAG gotcha. power equipment feel. dealer. I'd love to see one cry. Hey folks, I'm Dennis Gantz and welcome to this week's show. I may be dressed warm, but we're going where it's going to be really warm. We're off to coastal Maryland when we're on a quest for the majestic Sika deer. David, Jim, and I are going to be spending six days in the swamps of the eastern shore with our friend Chris Walliser, owner of Buck Cage, and we're going after the ghost of the coast. Stick with us. He just, yeah, he just called this morning. That's good. Push the ratchet down, make sure it's locked down. Yes, hon. Um, oh. I'll pack ready to go to the beach. Can't wait. We told our, we told our wives we're going hunting. We told our wives we're going hunting. We're hanging out. Oh, I thought you heard mm. us. <laughs> I'm a big beach goer. Yeah, I can tell by those white legs. <laughs> Whackham broadheads are very sharp. Very. David can tell you about it. There it is. It went through not only the finger, but the fingernail. So, so if there's any footage that's blurry in season two from this hunt, it's, it's my fault. focus finger. It's his focus finger. So. <laughs> <laughs> I can honestly say we've had a really fun trip so far. We hit some rain on the way down. Uh, we had a lot of laughs. We had a really close call with our big jar of peppers, but we're excited and can't wait to get to the hotel, get ourselves unloaded, meet up with Chris, and get and do some scouting. How does it feel to go from 65 to zero, Jim? <laughs> are the peppers okay? The peppers Check, are good. Are the peppers. Check, Check the peppers. Yep. Getting close. Just talked to Chris Walliser, owner of Buck Cage, who's down here, gonna be hunting with us all week. And uh, he's been out scouting a little bit today, prior to our arrival. Find a lot of good sign. So we're excited. We wish we could hunt today, but it's Sunday and on public land you can't you can't hunt Sundays in Maryland, so we just gotta enjoy the trip and enjoy the sights and uh, Make sure all our camera equipment, our gear is ready to go. And get up first thing in the morning. It's gonna be a great week. I'm pretty excited. This is the place. At first, I said, please look under Chris Walliser or Mountain High hunting. And, uh, she had this dumbfounded look on her face. She's like, we're not showing any reservation. I'm like, okay. Try Penny. She's like, oh, there it is. I'm like, we're Wild good. Wild Hunting is proud to partner with these fine sponsors. I block the wind, the cold, I block the rain, noise, and smells. I block the voice in your head that says, go home. Scent blocker. Sure, having a big cut diameter, a body made out of 100% hardened stainless steel, and a cut on contact tip are very important. But when it comes down to it, two holes are just better than one. We put our Wacken Broadheads up against some of the leading mechanicals in our pass-through test. Let's see how they did. That 
That's why I shoot Wacom Broadheads, the sharpest, toughest, most accurate broadhead ever. Hey guys, if you want to find out where I'm at or the rest of the Wild Bout hunting team, check us out on all our social media outlets, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Instagram and Twitter. And don't forget, for short videos and tips, subscribe to our YouTube and Vimeo channels. The all-new Gunny at 334 per second and patented ZT lock limb pockets, it packs a punch hunters rely on. Crafted with a short, versatile 30 and 5 8 axle to axle and fast, smooth MXB cams, your prey stands no chance. Moxie Archery, where accuracy begins with craftsmanship. This segment of Wild Bout Hunting <laughs> is brought to you by Blue Ridge Polaris. Satisfaction guaranteed. We finally got all of our gear unloaded and into our room. We're ready to head out with Chris, check out the area, and see if we can't hear a few bugles tonight. See that big green sign way down there? It's the exit. Yeah. Well, well it's we close. are. I saw it on the way. We're in the truck and we got our buddy Chris with us. Oh, muskrat. Oh, why you gotta be that way? Huh? Why you gotta be like that? Muskrat. My eyes crossed now you because a... of that. I, I can't see. <laughs> see? See? <laughs> you jerk. <and> <laughs> now what? I take a right or left. Or I'm not, you know. Sharpie's trying to be funny. Calling the muskrat swerve. It says, it's like putting remember Neutrina or whatever. All non resident Neutrina. runners with archery must wear <laughs> 350 inches of horn. What? All non resident archery hunters must wear 350 inches of horn. Are you serious? Like it. Really? Do I look serious? Do you, have to, <laughs> do you have to be like that? We're going back to Walmart if we do. that. <laughs> <laughs> Is gonna be a fun a week, folks. Room. You know, I heard We're about that. That could have been what I heard in Swamp The what? What? Ruger Ruger. Oh yeah. From Louisiana. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what you really gotta watch for, and that's the fuck wet eagle. I had one of them caught in my shorts the other night. I got it pulled out. But yeah, fuck wet. <laughs> <laughs> Little guy, you know, they just gotta watch him. They try to lure you further into the swamp. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Say, Sharpie. Sharpie. Come a little further into the swamp. Yep. And now they're sounding the alarm. They probably heard them and they're like, we gotta get them out of there. I don't know. No. They're probably a motion detector. Well, I, they have it on a timer. It kicks on just periodically through the night. It'll do it every so many minutes or whatever. Always wanted to do it. You never came down. Right. And then four years ago, I came down and the first night I went in up there, I killed them. And I've been hooked ever since. I mean, I come down and to hear them and, you, and you'll have them well within bow range, but you can't see them in there, yeah. and they're screaming, and you hear them sloshing through. It, it, it's neat. Now, they're not big. No, but they're fun. But they're fun. They're fun. It's different, I guess. It's something yeah. different. Yep. White tails, I don't get the, the excitement. I mean, I, I go there, I'm there to shoot one. That's why yep. I'm there. Yep. I can have one of them come through. I can see it coming. My heart don't take off like it did when I was younger. These here, as soon as I hear that water, sploosh, sploosh, it's like, it's like a, a whole new, like a kid yeah. again. Which and it's probably that's why I like it so much. <coughs> this, this is this is this is a new 
There's the alarm. <laughs> That's a father one out. Yeah. That's out in another field. I'd love to see one across the road here. Oh. So would I. That would be so cool. Well, let's go. Let's go. I'll show you these other All places right. we're going to hunt at. Come on. We're going to check some more spots out. Well, the area is absolutely amazing. It's going to be a new type of hunting for us. We heard several bugles this evening. We hit a few more new spots to check out. And then it was off to Millie's Roadhouse for dinner and back to our room to get ready for the next morning's hunt. All right, Millie's Roadhouse. Millie's Roadhouse. Millie's Roadhouse. The Anna Merrill. Yep, so. Pork has it. Awesome food. Definitely awesome people. So if you're ever down here in Indiana, Maryland doing a little bit of hunting, make sure you stop by Millie's Roadhouse and tell them that Chris from Buck Cage and the boys from Wild Bow Hunting told you to stop in. They'll appreciate that. We're going to get ourselves here. It looks really good. Wild Bow Hunting is proud to partner with these fine sponsors. Payer Oil in McAdoo is family owned and operated for 50 years, employing all first responders extensively trained in hazardous materials. With our own supply of heating fuel and terminals on site, we add at no cost to our customers sludge solve treatment to eliminate sludge buildup and ensure your heating fuel burns efficiently. Need home heating assistance? Call us and we can assist you with dry heat and crisis programs. Open Monday through Friday and after hour emergencies. Stop in and see us at Payer Oil today. Hey, if you want to learn more about all of us here at Wild Bow Hunting, check us out on the web on the Wild Bow Hunting website. You can visit the outdoor shop for all the latest in apparel and products that we're going to be offering. Visit our partners page for links to all the companies that we deal with here at Wild Bow Hunting. And sign up for the Wild Bow Hunting newsletter that we send out every month with deals and tips of what's going on. So check us out, www.wildbowhunting.com. Samsung Productions can help you hit your target market. I would highly recommend Samsung Productions to work with. The quality is great. You're definitely going to get return on your dollar with them. I absolutely would recommend Samsung Productions. They get our message out to the community in a really good way. I would absolutely recommend using Samsung Productions to promote your business. They make it extremely easy for you, and they're definitely on time, and they're extremely professional. Check us out online, samsungproductions.com. It's here, the most innovative field dressing kit ever, developed by Raptor Razor. Its huge ergonomically designed hook on the Mako cuts quick with precision. The big game Skinner cuts through the toughest of places, saves you time in the field. Each kit comes with multiple blades, completely interchangeable. It's like no other knife made. For the full line of accessories, go to our website, www.raptorrazor.com. That's www.raptorrazor.com. This segment of Wild Bow Hunting is brought to you by Hunt Singers Karate, building confidence, focus, satisfaction, and accomplishment. All right, well we are, we're ready to hunt. Uh, we had a great night last night. Heard a couple of Sika stags bugling, saw some Sika. So, and it's all generally in the area where we're gonna be heading this morning. This morning where we're, where we're setting up, we're, we're kind of setting ourselves up for either whitetail or Sika this morning and uh, and see what happens and then this evening we're gonna hunt strictly Sika. So. Alright folks, it's our first set of our Maryland hunt. It's hot. It's uh, I believe it was like 80 degrees coming in here. We had some thunder and lightning early this morning. It's looking half decent right now, but we are supposed to get a lot of rain in here. Well, the rain's here, but I think it's here for good now. So I got the rain cover on the camera, hopefully you can hear me. I hear a lot of raindrops hitting it. It's 
these guys just opened up on us like you would not believe. We only got about a three hour hunt in this morning. By the time we all got back to the truck, we were soaked and all the gear was soaked. We got back to the hotel room, got everything dried out, a bite to eat, and that pretty much ended our day's hunt. But we did get back out in the evening, do a little scouting, and make a plan for the next morning. Well, we finally got our clothes dry. Um, now we have all our camera bags and backpacks in the dryer drying. Camera equipment's looking pretty good, and we're uh, having a little lunch, courtesy David there. Made ourselves made a about <coughs> how many seventy? Yep, seventy stuffed prosciutto peppers. We we got out a little bit this morning and just got completely drenched, dried all the equipment out. And uh, we came out just to cut, there's up here, there's another, there's a seeker right there. A couple of them. See them, David? Slow down. No white tail. Are they white tail? They're white tail. Are they white tail? We want binoculars out here. So I heard, there's, oh. That look like, anybody behind you? Got some deer back here on this little path, but we're, we're starting to see them. They're out moving in this in this rain. There they are, white tail. Oh, that's a sika. No, that was that was one. These sika, some of them have spots. So when you see a deer with spots, you get a little excited. They're here. It's exciting. Just had a bad opening morning with weather, but uh, we're pretty confident we're going to have good fortune this week. And it's just really cool being down here hunting these and seeing something different that we've never experienced before. And we're very grateful for Chris because he's a little bit more familiar with it and that's part of the do-it-yourself. You know, talking to people who hunt down here or may have come down here to hunt and, and get some pointers from them and in our case we're fortunate that Chris wanted to come down and hunt with us so you know, we got the best of both worlds. When it's public land hunting there's no guarantees but you got to be in a tree stand to do it. Unfortunately with camera equipment we've also got to watch the weather a little bit more. Fun morning, had him bugling, Jimmy had an encounter, David had some turkeys. So, let's see what the night holds. Wild Bow Hunting is proud to partner with these fine sponsors. That was nice. At Nightstar Munitions, we are family owned and operated. Open Monday through Saturday, selling new and used firearms in all your ammo needs. We are your superior safe dealer and specialize in AR rifles, Glock handguns, shotgun and rifle reloading supplies, and more. Stop by and see us at Nightstar Munitions. Hi, I'm Jeff Foxworthy, here to tell you about an exciting new product called the Buck Cage. The Buck Cage provides a quick and easy no mess solution for scent dispersal. Simply add half an ounce of your preferred scent and insert the dispenser. Within minutes, the polymer beads go to work absorbing the scent and are ready to dispense it for weeks at your favorite hunting location. The Buck Cage is Redneck approved and ready to help you cage your next buck. Get your Buck Cage and refill packs at buckcage.com. Bison is American. 
like backyard tailgates and touchdowns. Heading out on opening weekend and bagging that giant 12 point. Taking a weekend to get off the grid. No cell phone, no emails, just the great outdoors. That's the bison spirit. If you're looking for gear that works as hard as you do, bison coolers are made to last in the United States of America. Bisoncoolers.com At Black Creek Trapper Supply, located at 1124 Zenith Road, Nescapec, PA. We are family owned and operated. We're a complete buyer of raw hides and furs, offering baits and lures from new trap to use trap sales. We're your specialized Golden Hawk Canoe dealer. Come visit us at Black Creek Trapper Supply. There's an old one. This segment of Wild Bow Hunting is brought to you by Night Star Munitions. Handguns, rifles, reloading supplies, and more. Can't beat it. Well, we had a much better warning, lots of activity, but it's the evening sit now, and this one's all David. All right, everyone. This is uh, my first evening hunt. And we feel pretty good about the spots we're set up in tonight, so we have a big marsh out in front of us. It's filled, it's all frack. All this frack is all chewed up along the edges here, so sitting in a row of pines. It's pines all the way down to my left. And up to my right, probably about two, three hundred yards. A really good trail coming in right down here below us. It's coming right through where these two sections of frag meet together. All the frag is chewed on. So we're hoping that uh, we're hoping it happens tonight. everyone sorry we couldn't take you on the, the whole recovery Chris, but get in there yeah come on in Chris it's a little uh, rough going out there in the frag it's thick you can't see nothing with the camera but what a beautiful hind uh, did good buddy thank you you did good nice job congrats so there's my first uh, my first Sika deer beautiful deer beautiful so we got a good 45 minute hike yet just to get her back to the truck. <laughs> yeah, we do. <laughs> and what time is it now? I don't even know. I, don't I can tell you what time. Hang on. I'll tell you what time it is to give people an idea. When you go into the swamp, 
and you're hunting hard. Right now, it is a quarter of nine. And this is just, this is just how it works. You don't give up. And this was teamwork. This, this worked out really good. Yeah, I appreciate it, Dennis. Thank you very much. Good Dennis time, is behind guys. the camera right now. Appreciate all his help. <laughs> What a great first half of the trip so far. Congratulations, David, on your first seek of deer. It's been an amazing hunt, and we're so thankful to be sharing this with our friend Chris Walliser. We've got a few days left, so let's take a sneak peek at the conclusion to Quest for Sika. Closed captioning for wild bow hunting is brought to you by Terratech steel targets. Custom made steel targets. Down, huh? I freaked them out. <laughs> so, we're gonna go try and get them. <laughs> we're heading to the swamp. <laughs> the, the devil deer. <laughs> <laughs>